Hello to Dubai. Welcome to Dubai. Today, on day four, we will be going on a desert safari and we'll be ending the day with a ride on the yellow boats. But first, it's a desert safari, where it's a four hour trek in the um, desert. Just me in a private car. Um, yeah, sand boarding, I think they call it, a dune ride or something. And then there's a big car going over all the bumps and lumps and um, can ride a camel. Not sure if I'll do that yet, but have a look, but yeah. Desert Safari, oh yeah! Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Is it alright to video some things? Is it alright to use the video camera? Video camera okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. sure, yeah. Good. It's for YouTube. <laughs> been picked up. Time to start the desert safari. Yeah. Over um, Shibu is it? Shibu. Shibu. Me and Shibu. Are you way alone? Yeah, just me. Just me. What is it we do first at the desert? The ride desert first? Yeah. Yeah. And Shibu just said it's near the um, 72 miles from the Oman border. Oman border. So, yeah. That should be fun. How long does that last? Is it... That's up to your uh, ah, right. condition. You said uh, when you want to stop, then I. All ah, right, okay. Yeah, that's uh, unlimited. When I'm sick. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, it's just said camel rides included in the price, so I think we'll be doing a camel ride. Letting air pressure down so we can have the bumps and lumps better. That's where we're heading anyway, just over there. See the roads, no traffic on the roads at all. It's only early in the morning as well. 7.43 a.m. First we head to the camels. Camel ride. Tata! Aja. What desert is this? And is it got this desert? Yeah, is the name? Name of this desert is Al Badayar. Al Badayar. And this is Al Badayar. That side is Al Ramul. Okay. And other side is Al Madam, close to Omar. What's up? It's one way to see the desert on top of a camel.
Now what is it? Hit the desert? Yeah. yeah. Head into the desert. Top of the desert, time to take some pictures. Oh wow. <laughs> Look at that. That is just absolutely stunning. Wow, 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 wow. to do some sandboarding now. <laughs> Never done it before in my life, but we'll give it a go, eh? See, position. You have to hold your feet here. Yeah. Just keep here. And deep down, maximum. Over. And if you feel falling, sit down. Okay. Suddenly sit down. Don't go to hit forward. Because the sand is soft, nothing will happen, but you don't want to fall. You can just leave the safe. Okay. Yeah, I will take video. Yeah. So John starting uh, trying to uh, sandboarding. First time. Yeah. Okay. Camera running. Okay, go. Yeah. Keep going. Okay, come up and try again one more time. See, don't want speed. Okay. <laughs> Make slow, slow and lean more down, same like if you are feeling, just sit down, okay? Okay, try. Keep going, keep going, keep going. <laughs> Yeah. It's tiring, isn't it? Yeah. Sand, uh, like a bit of sand. Oh, yeah. Sand. It's sand. If Shabu ever asks me again to do sandboarding, make sure I tell him no. <laughs> I'm alive. I'm still alive. I'm sure. Oh. So Shibu's going to show us how to drive in the desert. Off he goes. Oh yeah! Whoa! Come on! 
отчего. Yeah, man. I just been down there as well. Yeah, brilliant. Thank you very much. That was really good to hear. Yeah. That's what I call a desert safari. Falling on my ass. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be getting sand out of my skin for the next two weeks. Maybe I should have gone to ski Dubai first and practiced. Yeah. <laughs> How good was that, eh? Brilliant riding from Shibu. Camel ride, desert safari, and what do they call it? Snow sandboarding? God, did I fall flat on my ass. I went flying. That climb back up to Shibu when I fell, man, that was hard. I was so out of breath. So hot. Honestly, it was so hot. I felt sick once I'd got back to the top of him. <laughs> oh, well. Don't mess about in the desert. And you see he's now he's spraying his car out with air pressure because half the desert's in his van. What a fantastic day. That desert safari was amazing. Back at the hotel, I'd like to thank Shabu, thank you very much for today. I've had a really good time. Um, I'll give him my YouTube in a minute, he's gonna check up on his video in a couple of months. So, yeah, thanks a lot, Shabu. Now, back to get showered and get half the desert off me. <laughs> okay, so I'm back at the metro. How good was that desert safari? That was brilliant. Um, yeah, I'm heading to Palm Jumeirah. So I need to be in that area for quarter past six tonight. I have a yellow boat ride. And the yellow boats are meant to be one of the best things to do here. So yeah, it's been a great day already. But I haven't eaten yet. I need some breakfast before we head there. So I'm off to jump on the old metro, um, get to Palm Jumeirah, and then I have to catch a tram to Palm Jumeirah. But when I get off the metro there, I might look for something to eat first. So breakfast, Palm Jumeirah, Lost Chamber, walk about Dubai Marina, and then yellow boat taxi ride. One other thing, my sewn is playing up again. I will use it when I get it working, but have you noticed a little black dot on it? I'm not sure. It shows up when it's with a clear background. When it's filming structures and everything, it doesn't show up. So there's something obviously on my lens. Um, I'm seriously thinking of getting a new camera, whether I get it in Dubai or somewhere else. I am seriously thinking it, because that sound has caused me nothing but trouble. I thought I'd fixed it, obviously I haven't, but yeah, could be getting a new camera, but I will use the Sony when it starts working again. Apologies for that little black mark, but there's nothing I can do. I'm in Dubai, I'm not giving it to anyone if I'm going to get a new camera anyway, so Canon at the minute, could be Sony, I'm not going to say when I change and that, but Let's go. And the only other bad thing about this cannon, there's no micro muffs blocking the wind out. That could be a problem as well, so we'll make do. I have this, I have my Sony, I have my iPhone, I have my Polaroid Cube. I'll be good. I still can't get over how good that desert safari was. I absolutely loved that. Did you see? Oh man, my shower. I told you about my shower. There was sand everywhere. Oh my god. In my ears, behind my ears, all over my head. Oh jeez, I went fucking flying. <laughs> Where's mine? Nope. Oh, that was brilliant. 
absolutely brilliant. Opinion of the Palm Jumeirah. It looks amazing, doesn't it? It's shit. Far too busy for me. Far too busy. I didn't like that at all. Far too busy. Not my thing. Look at this car. That's nice. Like I've said before in other videos, I'm not really into cars, but that's nice. So this is Dubai Marina. I'm on the Yellow Boat Store, which is like the famous one. And I presume that's it over there. Yeah, the Yellow Boats. They're the ones. Yeah, the Yellow Boats Tour, Dubai Marina. And if you look them up, the Yellow Boats Tour, they're like one of the best things to do in Dubai. So, yeah, be going on one of those. Mine's a 75 minute tour. I'll be exactly on one of them, leaving it. Mine leaves at quarter past six, so it's a while, yeah. One and a half, no. Yeah, one hour and 45 minutes. That's definitely gonna be good. No. Looking forward to that. This morning in the desert, this afternoon, this evening, on the water. The, I must admit though, when I was at that Palm Jumeirah, the sea did look a bit rough, so... And we go around there, so that should be good fun. I guess this is where the billionaires park the boats in here. A wooden boat. Oh, Captain Jack, I was looking at that one to go on, but I decided on the yellow boat instead. Yeah, that Captain Jack looked quite good as well. It was between going on a yellow boat or that Captain Jack one. The Captain Jack's the wooden one. Wow, look at that. Look at that. How much do you think that's worth? Let me have a growth. Two million? Two million pounds, I mean. 
No, yeah. Down through 60 each for now. Ah, I've got one booked for later, mate. Cheers. Speedboat there. Same as in New York. I remember what they call the one in New York. It looks exactly like that though. Jaws or something. But yeah, I'm not going to walk the whole length of the marina, but from what I can see, that's the best one here. There's a party boat on its way out. Time to go in some aircon, I think, for an hour until I can go clock in with the yellow boats. A great view. Look at the skyline here. Imagine having one of these. You wouldn't open your curtains to rain very often, would you? I saw a Costa coffee up there, so that's where I'm heading. Time to go on the yellow boat. I think there's about eight of us, seven or eight of us. That's where we're heading. We're heading over there. Let's go. Amazing. I got myself a sign I need to take home. Now I just need to find a taxi. Taxi! Taxi. Okay, let me end day four in Dubai there then. What a fantastic day. We've done the desert safari, had a look around Palm Jumeirah, and then we've just done that water bowl. Um, the yellow water boat, sorry, yellow yellow boat tour. <laughs> Amazing. Apart from the Palm Jumeirah, which I found not for me at all, but maybe for you. That was a brilliant day. Absolutely loved it. Um, yeah, that's day four finished. Like, comment, subscribe, share, everything like that, all that shit. Um, it's been brilliant. I've just got a taxi actually from Dubai Marina to my hotel, the Arabian Park, which is in Al Jadaf. So if you look on the map, you'll see how far that is. 27 minutes in the taxi cost me 14 pounds <laughs> unbelievable so cheap the taxis um yeah day four has been great tomorrow day five in dubai it's a helicopter i think in the morning so i'm going to go in have my food thank you everyone again your support means a lot um you've been messing me on facebook quite a lot i've had about 20 messages in the last three days which is pretty good going so thank you very much everyone I'll see you all tomorrow for day five in Dubai. See you all later.